Now, we actually got two experts with us from the oh. TV show Tattoo Fixers. We've got uh, Pash and Uzi. Which, I'm so sorry, which one is Pash? Which, I'm Pash. Pash, hi, I'm Pash Uzi. and Uzi. Now, um, have you seen a rise in the popularity of tattoos? Absolutely. Um, I, I, in combined, we have about 20 years' experience in tattoos. And from the beginning of our career until now, the, it, there's been such an increase in, in tattoos. Uh, the popularity and the, the clientele base has grown massively over the years. And, and, it, and it's also changed massively as well. I mean, it used to just be sailors and, and um, just your average uh, normal class people getting tattoos. And now it's, um, it's solicitors, it's doctors, it's people who work in banks. Yeah. And have you noticed then that employers look on them more favorably? Actually, this study comes as quite a surprise to us. It's, uh, it's something that we haven't thought of in the past, but uh, we can only suggest that the reason for this is because there's so many people that have tattoos these days, it's common ground. It's, uh, you know, it's something in common with, with the, the people that they're employing. Uzi, you've, you've got tattoos, haven't you? Pash hasn't. Yeah. So, Uzi, do you yeah. look at Pash and think he's a bit of a loser? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? Sometimes I wish you'd just man up a little bit and get the job done. Okay, can we see some of your tattoos? Yeah, I've... I've oh, sorry, wrong arm. Yeah. I've got this one here. And what does yeah. that mean? Why did you get that? Why is it important to I you? I mean, a lot, a lot of people feel that they should get a tattoo because it has to be something deep and uh, meaningful. But um, for me, every, every tattoo that I have is just a beautiful piece of art that I want on my body. So that's the reason why I have this one. So Actually, that, that person um, on your yeah. arm isn't anyone in, in particular, that lady there? No, no. not anyone. I mean, I mean, I'd like to meet her, because she's damn fine. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm any other examples you've got that you've done? Yeah, um, would you like us to show yeah, you a, a poster of our work? Oh. Actually, Uzi having this tattoo done was the only reason that I employed him in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Wow. wow. So here's some, because uh, we specialise in realism, and here's some of the more recent work that we've done. Um, it takes it takes a considerably amount a, a, a huge amount of hours yeah. to get this piece of work. I mean, Pash, uh, you tattooed don't have any. Pash, you don't have any tattoos, and you describe yourself as a vegetarian butcher. <laughs> <laughs> That's correct. That. Yeah, I mean, the reason why I haven't got any tattoos is because it's it, for me it's an important decision to make, and uh, throughout the years, even back when I was an apprentice, the, the guy that taught me said, "Why don't you just get a heart with mum written in, uh, in the middle of it?" And if I were to look back at that now, I'd be in shock, you know, I'd, I'd be quite worried at how, how I'm going to be trying to get it off. Yeah. You know, so it is, it is a, a choice that has to be made with, with um, you know, with, with great decision. And he's just afraid of needles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who's eating past you? It's great to talk to you. Thanks very much indeed. So, it's a Nick. That, that skull, the mm. one on the right you saw there. Yeah. I mean, would you, would you give someone a job if they had that on the, the right of their face or something like that? Well, it depends. Yeah, I think I would, actually. I think, well, it would depend how good they were and whether they shake my hand at the end of the interview. <laughs> I'm only kidding. I'm only kidding. No, it would probably depend on... Uh, yeah, if they're the right person, go for it, I would say. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah.